you're being lied to. I'm gonna show you how to actually lift your eyes with makeup because everyone on here is doing it wrong. So these are my eyes, no makeup, no filter. My hair's not tied up, so there's no ponytail facelift action going on. I'm gonna need you to forget everything you've been taught about the placement of your concealer. So I'm gonna start my concealer from my lower waterline, not my lash line, not over here like this. No, 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 we're gonna start from the outer corner, literally, and go up, okay? Not out, up. So I'm going over this little like fat pouch that goes into my brow bone as you can see because usually if you put your concealer like this okay and then you look straight it's gonna go like that in a curve right but we want to avoid that curve because we're creating a new shape and you want to take your concealer and bring it all the way underneath your lash line we've all seen that filter right that gives you like the crazy white under eyes yeah we want to bring the concealer like right right where the lash line is not done blending but you can already see how the eye is going up i'm going to show you what not to do on the other side so what people do usually is they just put their concealer on here which does absolutely nothing like it might lengthen your eye but it's not lifting it here's a side by side so you can better see what i mean so i'm done blending and you can see the two key elements in action this part over here creates a new highlight so that your natural shadow of your crease and your fat pad over here are not making your eye like look dragged down like this is heavy you know and this part over here where you put the concealer really close to your lash line makes it so that your dark lashes aren't going to pull your eye down over here you know they're not creating as much of a shadow you're erasing that shadow with the concealer as best as you can i'm going to move on to the inner corner thing because so many people are doing it wrong you do not want to pull your inner corner in towards your nose absolutely not you want to pull it down studies show first of all that an inner corner that goes down is more attractive than an outer corner that goes up secondly if you pull it down obviously that's going to create an illusion that this part is lower than this part so this part is going to seem higher i need to focus for this part but okay you want to start here and go only down strictly down see i didn't go in i went down and with a brown color not black here we are before adding shadows sephora single shadow in 282 my dear nude it has to be a very cool toned brown okay we're going to use this dense pointy brush and what we're going to do is we're going to start here over your eye and go up in a straight line regardless of your crease okay straight line avoiding the brow bone oh my god i'm running out of time and bring it down in a triangle but right here not where your eye ends okay you can see there's a space here where my lid ends i'm not doing it sorry i'm running out of time follow for part two